Good morning, my dear students. Once again, I welcome you all on my channel, English Vision. I am Mrs. Shivi Kodar. Wishes you good morning. And hope for the calmness, for the goodness in you. Today, we will learn the standard eighth chapter of of the book Exploring English. This is the second unit. That's the name is which and who. It is the part one, reading one. And in this chapter, the writer who is female has given the description in the humorous way. Humorous, maza. Comedy way mein usne apne is story ko thoda sa prastut kiya hai कि जिससे हमारे रीडर्स को हमारे यंगस्टर्स को थोड़ी सी स्टोरी में इंटरेस्ट नाउ दिस टाइम ईच एंड एवरीवन इज नोइंग अबाउट द ब्लॉग एंड डॉग्स सो हियर आल्सो द राइटर दैट इज द फीमेल यशोदा ला शी इज आल्सो द ब्लॉगर व्हाट इज कॉल्ड द ब्लॉग ब्लॉग इज अ वेबसाइट और पेज इन व्हिच द पर्सन द इंडिविजुअल राइट्स हिज or her important information so here she also writes in the form of writing in the form of play in the form of chapters stories and she gives the humor particles so let's see what is the story tells read about a woman's experience of submitting her young children's passport application Written for her blog, this piece is a humorous description of the confusion she had to deal with at the passport office. The story starts when the writer is going to be the blogger in which she is giving the experience and the modification, and she is wanting to share her experience for submitting the passport of her young children. she is also giving the humorous description the comedy description in the confusion she gives the pun 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 is like a figure of speech in which there are two different meanings one meaning is for the humorous for the comedy and the other is for the real meaning. so whenever the meaning arises the humor arises the comedy then there will be the pun so the, here are too many words which is having the pun the figure of speech the poetic device and it is having the humorous experience so let's see what will be there what will happen in the passport office for the longest time vijay and i had thought of the idea of getting passports for our twin boys We had only ever traveled to the United States once with young Peanut, our daughter, for the longest time. Me, so many time has been passed, and Vijay and I, Vijay, the husband of the writer Yashodanda Lal, they were having the idea in their minds, and they were wanting to get the passports for the twin boys. They were having two sons. They were twins. We had only ever traveled to the United States once. when young peter are dot they were there to go on the traveling to the united states only a single time and with their daughter peter the peter is the name of the dot even how it is comedy na peter can be the name of the daughter no so here is the essence of the humor Even now, Vijaya would ask her what she remembered from the trip, and when she drew a blank, she would he would say, "I meant, see, what was the point of that expensive ticket? She was two years old at that time." Even now, Vijaya would ask her, means from there till now, the husband, the of the writer and the papa of Vijaya Pinar, they he was there to ask about the trip. He was. they are to ask that she has remembered about the trip or not she was wanting they were wanting to do back the attention on the trip but she was going blank she was not having anything to describe and he would have sighed and lament means when he saw that 
his daughter is not having anything to describe he is not have uh, she is not remembering anything when the father was named named crying in sorrow he was sighing and he having deep sigh deep breath and saying see what was the point of that expensive ticket you are not knowing me she is saying to her his daughter that she is not knowing about the expense of the ticket you should ask each and everything you should remember each and everything but she was too much old too much young that time because she was only 2 years old but we didn't have that excuse given that the boys were now over 5 years old so we kept telling each other we should get passports done for the twins and that we would agree solemnly and proceed to do exactly nothing about it but we did not have the writer is saying that they were not having any excuses means unke paas koi bhi aisi cheez nahi hai koi bhi aisa baat nahi hai ki jo wo kar sake ya usko chhod de that the given boys were now over 5 years old but their children their twin boys have the age of 5 years but they kept telling each other we should get passport that for the twins now they needed the passports they are saying that they needed the passport because they are younger and they were angry solemnly here the solemnly means serious less means they were too much serious in the this matter the years of course they needed the passports and proceed to go do exactly nothing about it now they were wanting to do but nothing was there to do to achieve the passport I was going through our files recently and saw that Peanut's passport had expired. Now she was saying that she was going through our files recently. Means they were having the documents now. Each and every one have the documents in the files. So she went go through the files and she was searching the documents, the passport, and she saw that only the daughter's passport peter's passport have been expired now here the meaning expired is having pun ha huh? means it is having two meaning passport can be expired means die ho sakta hai ha huh? nahi lekin yahan par expired ka matlab hai it is officially logically has been failed means the date which were issued to go to the foreign country through this passport has been failed so it is having the humor that the passport has been expired but it cannot be expired what said vijay vijay was surprised and shocked and he asked what is this i showed it to him more than 5 years and have passed his wife what got hers and it was actually almost a year ago that the passport had expired i showed it to him now the writer is saying that she showed the passport to her husband and more than 5 years have passed means 5 saal bit gaye hain jab unhone uska passport banwaya tha and now almost 1 year has been passed to expire the passport means ek saal ho chuke hain ki wo passport expire ho chuka hai khatam ho chuka hai iski date jo issue ki gayi thi wo date validity khatam ho chuki the girl reached us into action that it reminded me went hunting online for the passport website of the government here girl vanished girl vanished me shocked but here the meaning is took action so they were wanting to take the action for the passport they needed to go to the passport office for issuing for reissuing the passport the new passport of their daughter peanut so the writer determined it means evidently she was hunting the online me she was searching the to fill the form of the passport and she was working the government website and here here it means that she got the website and in the website she was searching and she was getting something it is for those of you who are versed in me in such matters in the website it was written that some of the people were having the confusion or worriness and they were not getting anything for their purpose so they can immerse myself in figuring out the forms and documents required in about an hour i had the forms fairly longish filled 
and emerged. Emerged here emerged means involved. Means the people, those who are having the problem to reach to the for passports, they can involve here, they can fill the form. So the writer is saying that she was herself wanting to involve in this matter for the documents, for the forms, for the requirements. And in about one hour, she got all the things she filled up for. We took the appointment at the passport office and for all the three kids, the slot was 9.45 a.m. to 10 a.m. Now, he got the appointment or they got the appointment, she got the appointment at the passport office and the time was given and they were having the three kids, two twin boys and one daughter, all the three kids were having the appointment and the time was 9.45 to 10. This more the strain. How would we manage to do it all the three at the same time? It still be resolved philosophically. We would just have to see. She was shocked and surprised that within 15 minutes, how it will be possible to arrange all the things for these three kids. She was not having any patience. She was shocked and she was not getting any point to solve all the problems. So, she was saying that we have to arrange all the things. The day before the appointment was filled with confusion. It was all very well to fill in forms online. But I had given the responsibility of getting all the documents attested, photocopy, etc. to my husband, who put it off till about the midnight of the last day. Whenever we go to the officially purpose in the office or legally purpose in the office or the government office then we needed the attested photocopies means we needed the photocopies the xerox copies of the documents and all the xerox copies they needed the signature of the authorities through which they come to know that all the informations are true so here also the appointment was the day before the appointment was filled with confusion means they were having the confusion and they were filling the form and they were having the confusion because all the things were going the online means they filled the form online but they having the responsibility to arrange all the papers so all the documents on the papers were printed, were xeroxed and attested. Attested, the another meaning it as this is endorsed. Endorsed and attested are the synonym with each other. So they were having the signature to show that the documents are correct, the profiles are correct. And her husband was there to do all the things, to do all the arrangement, to prepare all the documents. Last night, up to midnight. So we were tense and arguing with each other. Rather, I was tense and arguing with him while the family went around arranging the papers, whistling softly to himself. I admit he needed up doing a pretty job, good job with multiple backup copies, everything, even the things that we didn't need. I so we were tense and arguing with each other means the husband was preparing the documents, the papers, but the writer was having the confusion. So in the confusion, in the arrangements, they were having the arguments with each other. But she was too much tense and arguing, but he was calmly, the husband was calmly doing the work, arranging the papers and he was whistling. When we do the whistling, when we are in mood. So he was whistling, he was having the whistle and he was admitting, she was admitting that she will get, she will do all the things, all the purpose, all the copies in the proper manner. But everything, even the things that we didn't, didn't need, all the things they were needing, were all in for the purpose and they were having the sure assurance that they were getting all the things in the proper way. Election edge, a mysterious thing, but we found a copy online check, both the first sign check. Election edge means there are so many papers, so many pages in the form. So in election edge, 
are mysterious thing means a serious uh, hidden thing was there and they find that a copy of online should be there they were checking both were signing and they were there to check all the things passport copies of parent with spouse name and dots and check and dots means attested yes the passport copies of parents were also there to show the verification that the children the kids are of these parents and they check and they put the copies and they sign birth certificate self attested wait they this mean we had to attest for the kids never mind we could figure it out there check aadhar cards as proof of address check birth certificate self attested means they were getting the birth certificates also they were getting and they were having then this mean we had to attest or the kids means they were confused they were having the confusion that the kids signature should be there or no but they didn't mind that thing and they bit they figure out all the things they solve out all the things and they check all the things and the proof of the aadhar cards the address were also there they were checking each and everything from on the appointment day we took three excited kids who had no idea what to expect to the passport officer of no bihar on the appointed day now the appointed day has come and they were too much excited they were having the three kids and all the three kids were having the excitement because they were getting the new passports and they went there in the globe yaar the passport office was in the globe yaar pickle and papar especially were thrilled at the idea of getting their passport pickle and papar what is pickle and papar achar aur papar ha huh? but here the comedy is there pickle and papar is the names of two twin kids the boys pickle and papar are the name of the boys so they were having especially the thrilling the excitement for getting the passports they clearly thought that the minute they had the little booklets in their hand they would be this thing off to america or london or even asia and they go to they were having the clear thought that whenever they will get the passports they will visiting off visiting off moving off or they will visiting off to go to america or london or any in any asia when they will get all the things on the passports my heart sank at the side of the building it looked like every unordered dirt old building but it was the air of a quiet depression desperation among the people lining up then we realized that there were not really that many people my heart sank at the sight of building now he was or she was seeing the building but the building was too much confused they were what was there she was not getting the point but she was confused she was getting nervous it looked like every dull old building why she was nervous because it was the old building and it was dull but the air of the quiet desperation among the people lining up means the air was there each and every one was in the line queue and the air was moving here and there for the quiet then we realized that there weren't really that many people now soon they know come to know that there are not the people who are related with the passport issue in fact people are being assured in fairly quickly but the people those who are there are assured assured call chatting talking with each other for the work quickly we went through the and smiling security checks and found ourselves in a waiting area with some people smiling around we went through the and smiling security checks now they entered in the security checks and found that they were waiting they had to wait in the waiting area and some people also milling around means mixing and coming they here and there there were four or five counter and i sat down with the kids when we came and they stood in the line with the papers now we were four and five count there were four and five counters i and i sat down with the kids on the bench and vijaya went there to line up in the queue and he stood there with the papers 
So now what will happen again and what will be the story, we will continue it tomorrow. Have a good day. Bye-bye.